Hey, this is Frank. This is the open differential from our Acura RSX six-speed transmission. And we're going to look at uh, removing the bearings, or at least one of the bearings, and then removing the speedo ring from this differential. So uh, we don't really care much about this bearing because we're going to be putting in a new LSD into the transmission with new bearings. But we want to try to recover this speedo ring. So what I'm going to do is I've got this pickle fork and a hammer and I've already started but I just get it So it created quite a bit of clearance here and uh, it may be enough so that we can put a bearing puller so we pounded enough that we can get this puller set up and uh, we just set it in the vise for stability and we use the normal pulling technique okay And that takes care of removing this bearing. So we're going to try to get this speedo ring off using a traditional kind of puller. You can see here, I'm just holding the differential in the vise for stability. Let's try with a little bit bigger socket wrench. There we go. One speedo ring coming right up. Okay, so here's where we stand. This is our open differential, the original from the transmission. We removed one bearing, we removed the speedo ring. We're going to be installing a limited slip differential into the transmission so we're going to be putting new bearings on it and we will reuse this pedo ring so that finishes up what we're doing with this and uh, you might ask well why did we have to remove the bearing in order to remove the pedo ring and here's the answer okay this uh, would have never come off from underneath this bearing the bearing had to come off first and uh, thanks for watching stay tuned for the coming episodes of this series on doing a case swap into an MR2 spider